Alright. Wow, we have... I have really lightened up my pack. Dang. Woo! Wait, oh, did I put away a light shining in the darkness? No, I want to fuck around with that. Is it under A? Yes. Vault? In a vault. In a vault. In a vault. Look, I would, I would kiss Mr. New Vegas's boys. Yeah. Like, I just would. Um, speaking of characters from Guilty Gear, uh, because this is now, I've decided this is now a Guilty Gear stream, even though a couple of Tuesdays ago I did a Guilty Gear stream. They can switch to Guilty Gear if you want. Uh, hey there. Prim has a new sheriff. No, it's fun. No, we don't actually have to switch to the game of Guilty Gear. But, um, I think about Guilty Gear a lot, because I play a lot of Guilty Gear. <laughs> Those but, gears uh, sure are guilty. They oh my joking. god. No, they really weren't. What were they guilty of? Uh, existing. Oh. That's- oh. Uh, it's- it's bad. It's a hellish existence. Actually... Livy, I'm gonna ask you this, because Hannah, I think you may know the answer to this. Livy, so Hannah, don't don't give it away if you don't if you feel like you can help it. Livy, who do you think the guilty gear is? Um, uh, Bison. <laughs> who? Raul Julia as Bison. <laughs> <laughs> The guilt are the gears we made along the way. Damn it, MGS3. Also, thank you for the follow. I just saw that. Oh my god, holy <laughs> shit. Oh my god. Damn, your leg is gone. <laughs> that was embarrassing. Evie, get out of the kitchen. Holy shit. Evie. Evie, no. No. Oh my god. No, get out. That's bad. Evie, get out of there. Oh, is one of my legs broken? Are you crouching? Tiger? I think you're just crouching. Oh. Hidden dragon? <laughs> <laughs> Livy, that was extremely funny. Man. Crouching tiger, hidden dragon? Really? Man, Man crouching on the ground, jumping to get around. Boone, I think my leg is broken. Boone, my leg's broke. Boone, my leg is broken. Boone. 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 like a frog. Yeah. Boone, my leg is broken. Boone's just, Boone is just like. Evie, Boone. no. Are you okay? Evie. <laughs> no, wait. Evie, no. Wait, do I have Evie. to go through there to get to. Oh, no, probably not. Get out. Shit keeps going in the yeah. kitchen. No, uh, no, uh, Livy. Um, there is a character in Guilty Gear who is known as the Guilty Gear, and I was wondering if you could have guessed who it was. Uh, Libby is currently away from the computer because our cat keeps getting into the kitchen. I see. Like a silly Sally. Well, Hannah, do you know who the Guilty Gear is? No. Oh, do you have a guess? Uh, is it... Ju justice? No, it's not justice, but that's a good guess. Ah, uh, that is. I no like justice. She's hot. Uh, which? Well, wait, question. Wait, which version of justice? Now I now I'm. They're all hot. No, you're right. Even the JoJo Part Three one. <laughs> no, there's a character named Justice in Guilty Gear, and she's like a big dragon lady. She is a well, big dragon. Go look because she, justice... I hear big and lady in the same sentence, and you know I go the pog. Yeah, no, she's she's a big dragon lady. She's also a big robot lady with a weird ant antenna on her crotch, and then she's also a woman. Yeah. Who's also oh, so fa she is the weapon to surpass Metal Gear. She actually Justice is the weapon to surpass Metal Gear. You're right. Yeah, it's There you might know, be a guy with a golf club in here. Watch out. Oh, uh, she's not my type of big lady, unfortunately. 
Yeah, no, there are. Yeah, there are. Yeah, no, there are. <laughs> ah, piss that, off! Yeah, that's gonna hurt in the morning. Driver, Watch, like don't shoot that guy in the head. Thing. That guy's special. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I am also losing so much health. Snake uh, like the solid? Yeah, snake as in. Or the cat. Snake is yeah, snake she's guilty. Like, snake is a like guilty Digimon gear. hot. Wait, which version? <laughs> The robot one, specifically. Oh yeah, the specifically the robot justice. Yeah, that's fair. Mm -hmm. Any other guesses for the Guilty Gear before I reveal who the Guilty Gear is? Is it uh, Soul? It is actually Mr. Bad Guy. What? That's, it, that's not his name. Yeah, oh, no, his, his, yeah. His name is Saul his Bad Guy. Is, yeah, his name is Saul Bad Guy. Yeah, he's named after a Queen song. Travis touchdown fuck racism, buddy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> See, you say that. Saul <laughs> Bad Guy? Yeah, his name is Saul Bad Guy. His... I think Bison is a better choice. Bison, bison. would. Uh, is it? Is it the fact that Bison is guilty or that he feels guilty? Because he definitely doesn't feel guilty. He does not feel guilty. Today's just another Tuesday for him. It's no. just Tuesday. It's just Tuesday. Is the thing. That's one spicy phoenix over there. Hi, spicy phoenix. Hi, spicy phoenix. We're um, we're killing people. We're figuring out who the guiltiest gear is. The guiltiest gear is Soul Bad Guy. Yeah, no, because he was turned into a gear against his will. Oh no, I'd be a bad guy too. Yeah, if you had magic accidentally put or purposefully put into your DNA to save humanity. Was, was his name Saul Bad Guy before? No, his name was Frederick because it, Freddie Mercury. <laughs> his name was Fred. Fred Bad Guy? No, Fred, <laughs> no, no, he had a normal last name like Bolsara. <laughs> Bolsara is not a normal last name. Shut up! Bolsara Vinegar? Shut up, there's a man named Oscar R. Cruz. <laughs> So, Fred Balsamic Vinegar. There's a man <laughs> named that man. I am not uh, unaware of the weird names. A fucking, in yeah, no, Fallout. there's. Fallout. I mean, yeah. uh, Guilty Gear. Yeah. Hannah, there are it's two men. Hannah, things. there are two men named that man. What are you talking about? There's that man and there's this man. Yeah, there's Asuka and then there's Happy Chaos. There's this man and that man. You can go with they, this they man. They are different men. It's true, they are different men. And then there's Bedman, who is not that man or this man, but he is a bed man. Yeah, he's a bed. Ma he's a bed man. Yeah, I'm a bed man. About yeah, the he also. Because Bridget is my favorite. No, Bridget rules. I like her yo-yo. No, Bridget. See, you Bridget say won't. that, but I main, I, I main Bridget. I play a lot of Bridget. <laughs> Bridget, the only yeah, cis trans woman. Born. I mean, we don't... Killed one of the wait, wait, what? Hold on. You said the only cis trans woman. Wait a minute. God damn it. Bridget's from a society that was all women and originally... Before... Before Bridget knew that she was a woman, she was a man. No, that's not... That's not the story of... That's not... Oh. Bridget at all. Perhaps... You... Perhaps I am... This I have misheard. No, Bridget was born a twin. Okay, I'm sorry. I've gotten. I, I'm in the. I'm okay. Hold on. I'm in the. There's local... another Bridget. No. Okay. Hold on. Bridget was born as a twin to a family in a society where uh. twins of the same gender are bad luck. So initially, oh. Bridget was raised as a woman because. Again, having oh, two twins of the same gender, and identity. and throughout, I had heard incorrect. Yeah, and I throughout apologize. Bridget's story, she's trying to figure out. Okay, well, I was raised as a woman this whole time, but I'm really masculine. And in Strive, it's basically she basically realizes with the help of Gold Lewis and Kai that the vice president of the United States of America. No, he's the sec. He's no, he's the a secretary of defense. Yeah, no, he's actually the secretary of defense. That's canon. They're the same thing. It's fine. They are not. It, it's very funny whenever you have like somebody with like an official, like government title. Lost a lot of good. I guess we get. 
You've been one. Yeah. You missed out on it, but there's a cool thing you can do with um with the uh, driver Neffy is um you can get the the snipers to lure him out. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Oh yeah, they can help you a lot. Yeah, but basic but basically the story behind Bridget is she goes through all that trying to figure out what masculinity means when you're originally raised as a woman. And then she figures out, no, I'm actually a woman. And this is through the realization of uh, Gold Lewis Dickinson being like, you're not a guy. Mm -hmm. Gold Lewis said, sparkle on, it's Wednesday. Don't forget to be yourself. <laughs> oh, somebody needs to please make that edit. <laughs> well, I mean, well, no, there are several drawings of Gold Lewis just being the best stepdad. He's good. Spark sparkle on, sparkle it's on. Wednesday. Don't forget to be yourself. Um, when posing the question of who is the hottest Guilty Gear character to other of my friends, one of my friends said Gold Lewis, and I'm like, you know what? That's fair. And then they immediately That's... said, well, well, they immediately also said, I just really want that old man dick. And I'm like, all right. <laughs> 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 I mean, they're valid. Gold no, Lewis they are. It just really, it really caught me off guard. <laughs> I, I still think Justice is pretty hot. Justice is pretty good. I mean... Specifically the Digimon-looking one. Yeah, that's fair. I mean, look, Testament's right there. <laughs> Testament is really hot. Oh, God, how did I forget about Testament? Well, Testament I, I still think Testament. Justice is hotter. See, that's a uh, bold statement, but I respect it. Old Testament or New Testament? Um, new Testament. Bad, Fresh bad. Testament. No, New Testament. Bad. New Testament. No, new Testament. Uh, Testament. Uh, Non-binary art uh, icon Testament. Testament. It was a really bad vibe. T Testament, story. sexy legs and abs. I wish I wish Testament had both. I, w I wish Testament had the abs in uh, the current version of their costume. I do kind of miss that. <laughs> Me slapping Testament's abs. <laughs> you grating cheese on Testament's abs. <laughs> Me grating cheese on Testament's abs. <laughs> Not I'm not going to say Soul because he's like six. Wait, S Soul bad guy is not six. <laughs> oh, I meant Sin. Sorry. Yeah, no, Sin is, Sin is a child. <laughs> Dizzy, he we... thinks that babies come out of eyeballs. It's true. He does believe that. Just like real life. Just like real life. <laughs> yeah, no, he does believe Soul, that. Soul bad guy should be guilty because he keeps lying to his child. <laughs> 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 it's good but you're going off later mgs thank you for stopping by it was good having you here hope you enjoyed have a good one later 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 oh i did not mean to take i did not mean to take all the weapon things why did i do that, that was why did you do that that was stupid of me that was, you're, you're a silly billy it's true, I am silly, but I'm not a Billy. That's true. Huh, got it. Caravan shotgun. Oh, God. Oh, Miss Kitty is staring out the window. Oh, is she Miss is Kitty looking. staring out the window? Here, have this laser. 3293. The sun oh. is a deadly laser. The sun is a deadly laser. laser. God, I have... I watched that video again, like, a month ago. It's really good. It's so bizarre. Holy, it's so weird. Bill Wirtz is a great artist. I love his work. He is extremely funny. <clears throat> so. <sighs> so that does 29 and 82. 86 and 29. I think I'm going to keep the mercenary grenade rifle. No, the grenade launcher does more. Uh, don't need this. I put away the golf club. I don't need the defender. Although the defender is pretty cool. Grenade, pistol, rifle, fist. Mines. Keep the modulator. Keep the pistol. Oh, I should use the riot shotgun at some point. Holy shit, so much weight. Yeah, I have so many fucking guns. Maybe it would be faster if you just, like, loaded a save. Oh, uh, eh. Maybe. 
Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, before I slept. You're sleepy. Well, speaking... Speaking of <laughs> going Look at, Look at her, babe! Look at oh, her cat! Is she, oh, is your cat being very silly? <laughs> Ma'am, miss girl. She's like pushing her entire face into the blind. Oh, miss girl. This new freak. Why is she such a freak? Why is she a genetic freak? Why is she fighting Samoa Joe at Hell in a Cell? I <laughs> have this picture of our cat. Your cat is adorable. I love her. She's an evil baby. She's she's very good. <laughs> she's just got her whole face in there. Let's see. Uh, we can wait to do like old world blues until later. Oh Let's yeah, go. you don't want to start that just yet. Yeah, no, I want to. I want to wait off. I don't. I don't know what DLC would be next for me though. It would be old world blues. It'd be old world. Okay. That one has a not good money. Well, it goes honest hearts, old world blues, dead money. Okay. What level? Uh... What what level do you recommend old world blues? Uh, the cat, the, they recommend 15 or above. Okay. You could go. Alright, but I will probably hold off on that, at least until seeing what the fuck a Benny is doing. What's a Benny Hana? What's a Benny Hana? That's a good question. <laughs> I thought my boss was a pain, so, okay, that's not what I wanted. Thanks for bringing us the news, Mr. New Vegas. New Vegas. Thank you, yeah. Mr. New Vegas. God, she's so fucking funny. God. <sighs> My love for you is like a truck. When she just keeps on going. Berserker. <laughs> Berserker barrage. Oh my god. God. God, what other dumb Guilty Gear things could I tell you all to break your brains? Do you know why uh, Bed? Do you know why Bedman's in a bed? Uh, he's sleepy. Okay. He, he's do, sleepy. Do you have any other reasons why he is in a bed other than he's sleepy? He took a melatonin. Any other? I mean, it's Guilty Gear. Do you have any other batshit reasons? Um, he wants the gears to take a nap. That would actually be pretty funny, but... <laughs> what the heck is this? Oh. Oh, well, they're dead. Oh, thank you, Edward. I think that was Boone. Oh, well, thank you, Boone. Maybe. No, the she re... looking outside. Okay, so the reason Bedman is asleep all the time is because his brain is too powerful for his goddamn body. And it literally causes his body to disintegrate and overheat. So if he's asleep, hey, where are you going? He can home? just act like he's, he's sleepy. That's a giant fucking rat. <laughs> rat. Get that is, of that rat. That's the rat who makes all the rules. Girly no, guy. there's there's more rats that make all the rules in a different location. Yeah. We've got stuff we're not even allowed to sell, people. Only at Mick and Stop by. Mick Maybe you shouldn't all say that. Need, sir. Open the door to Freeside. I like Mick and Ralph's. It's a good. It's a, they have quality goods. I believe it. Oh, hello. Quality goods and quality hoods. Can't wait to hit the Wrangler tonight. They should hire me. Damn, dude, you look great. Man looks like Elvis. I think that's the joke. Yeah. You know what? That's a good look, my dude. Keep on keeping on, my man. Keep it weird. Huh. Nice robot. You with the followers or something? It's gotten so bad that even I think twice before going out at night around here. Alright, well. Watch yourself. There's some unsavory types about. You know what? The Kings may be a violent game gang with uh guns at their hips, but they seem alright. They're not too violent. 
Well, that's good. I, I mean, when you have to... I mean, when you have to defend yourself, you have to defend yourself, right? Very much. They're... The kinks are very cool. Look, they're, they're chill out. They're, they're like if Elvis wasn't a dirtbag stealing from black music. <laughs> yes. I'm sorry, I'm an Elvis hater. <laughs> I mean, he credited Sister Rosetta Thorpe. Uh, that's good. Yeah, no, I know that. That's good. But it also does kind of suck that uh, he got famous off of all of the, you know, the foundational black acts when they did not get the same notoriety. That might not be so much his yeah, fault that's true. as it is the fault Those of just everything else. The same way that Fozier is basically doing the same thing as that. Uh, yeah, you know what? That's fair. I take that back. The name's Old Ben. I've been living Old Ben, you look like someone with a spray born. tan. I don't know if I trust you. I've done a bit of everything around here. Courier, butcher, crier, escort, gun for hire... Some of which I'm not proud of, but I do my best to help around town when needed. All right, buddy. Exactly one of the reasons I got out of that job. Too many shifty characters looking to have someone else move their hot items. Yeah. But, um, no, the reason Bedman... Hey, baby! Yeah, but what I was saying is the reason Bedman is asleep is because his brain will disintegrate his body if he's awake. So he has to be asleep. And the reason he has access to a robot is... He can activate the magic dimension when he's asleep. So he can pilot the robot using the magic dimension. Just like Pokemon. My father ran a butcher Yeah, just like town, Pokemon. But business went down just like Pokemon. Another vendor started selling Guilty Gear is Pokemon's future. Half our prices. You're telling me. Or Pokemon's my past. Father's shop went under. Mm -hmm. away from the loss. People around town started experiencing shakes. No one gets shakes like that unless they're eating human flesh. Ugh, no one would great. The sick bastard gradually went insane and passed away. <sighs> Wasn't long before someone moved into the guy's This dude is like info dumping all his trauma on your ass. Sex. Old Ben, you need to see a therapist, buddy. You so. What After is a while, she looking? I made enough money to get a passport into Vegas. Back then, you could get approved for entry for a fraction of what it costs now. Ugh, great. Well, I got a job working as a crier outside of the tops, advertising for the local talent performing at the casino. That didn't last long. Well, being a suave young guy, I chatted up the ladies from time to uh, time. Ah, I see. The Couldn't keep him. To take a liking to me. If Guido yeah, Sarducci were a sleazy businessman, this is what it looked like. Wow. All <laughs> right. Casino. Sure enough, a few grand was missing from the casino vault. I have to assume the bastard stole the funds and figured I was a convenient fall guy. Oof. Rough. Yeah, shit indeed happens. I was stripped <laughs> of my casino apartment and all of my belongings and booted back into Freeside. From there, I didn't have a lot Rough. of career options. Ah. Uh... destroyed. So the escort job sort of fell into my lap. No pun intended. Well, I suppose you could look at it that way, but... Yeah, no, well, yeah, this this is just a front load of information. No, escort just sounds <laughs> better than man whore. Ah. Uh, oh, so you got paid for sex. Yep. I was damn good at my job, too. You know what? After a while, I just... I, re I, I, I respect it. I you know what? We respect sex workers in this house. When I quit the escort job, I had enough money... Although I may not respect this man outside of his profession. <laughs> Bodyguards make a good, honest living. And I had the wits and physical build to handle most thugs. Sure, buddy. After saving a few tourists from trouble, I got a reputation for being a stand-up guy again. And after a decade, managed to save up enough to retire. What is it? All right, good for you, buddy. He, his whole story. All right. All right. What? Hi. What is... <gasps> good, hey. Baby. Submit to a credit check or present your Whoa. passport before yeah. proceeding to the gate. Trespassers will be shot. Uh. Oh. <laughs> I can cheat. <laughs> Admission to the strip requires an official passport or proof that you are carrying the required minimum balance. Oh. These policies prevent less reputable persons from entering and ensure a good time will be had. Oh, that's not good. That's literally redlining. Yep. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, sir. You may proceed. 
Oh! You can go forward. Oh yeah, that's like a... Um, that's a scripted event. event. Yeah. Oh, I feel bad for that guy. Me too. Oh man. What are you doing? I'm seeing what's up here. Okay. Yeah, no, it's just a guard post. Okay. Well, we did it. We made it to Vegas, baby. Wow. This is so much more. Had it, partner. Hey. Come for <laughs> Welcome to New Vegas. Victor. Consider me your personal welcome wife. Now hear this. The head honcho. Wait, this isn't Vegas. Victor. Mr. Oh, this is, it is weird. Built. It is Victor. Then why does it say Securetron Mark Just One? For the lucky it's Victor. It's the big old tower shaped like a roulette spinner. Victor, what's wrong, buddy? Well, now, it was Mr. House who made Securitrons like me. Seems the least I can do is pass on yeah. his message. Oh, this is yeah. weird. Oh, I don't... I, I'm scared now. Yeah. That's ominous. That, All right. that was really ominous, actually. What the hell? No violence is... Welcome to Vegas. What? Make your visit a peaceful one. What? That's a Securitron, Bobby. That was the uh, same Securitron, though. Vic Victor's right over there. He can hop. He's what? Hopping. Well, howdy, partner. I see you brought some friends. And they'll just wait outside the casino for you. They won't go all the way back. That's weird. I didn't realize Victor could fucking jump. He's hanging out. All right, lads, I'll be back soon. Well, howdy, partner. That's weird. That's weird. <laughs> why do you know Mr. House and why can you jump? I thought. Oh, okay. this. Oh, Don't worry about it. I'm a little. I'm a little nervous now. Oh my God, this is. Wait, why is it telling me to go back outside? You have a different quest selected. Oh, okay, I got. It. I'm like, wait a minute, what's going on? House always wins one, huh? So you activate those from. Oh no, not that one. Um, it's actually. Uh, there. You just tell Victor where to go. Ah, I see. Oh, I'm so nervous. Like, seeing... Why is it that Victor jumping makes me nervous? I don't know. I don't know. Well, hello, the Shula. feeling of being watched, maybe? Yeah, like I'm being watched. Like, I don't have control over this situation anymore, maybe. I'm Jane, one of Mr. House's girls. We keep him entertained. We don't get many guests lately. We have That's sweet robot sex. Well. <laughs> mm-hmm. It's like in Futurama where you plug one, where you plug like thing A into port B. Yeah, she's exactly from Futurama. She's the most Futurama character ever. Oh, that's exciting. What would you like to know? Can you turn the light on? Yeah. yeah. Just new money Front load information. Oh, it's also it's funny. Spicy Phoenix is one of my friends, uh, who I knew at a UMW. So, yeah, no, I didn't realize they sent me a message. I'm like, oh, right on. Well, she says something. Yep. But these days, there are three open to the public: the Tops, the Ultra Lukes. And the Ultra Lux. Ultra Lux? Ooh. Well, let's see. The NCR has an embassy here, but why you, <laughs> to to you don't want to talk to them? I surely don't know. Oh, and the Vault 21 Hotel gift shop has an adorable collection of old Vault Tech memorabilia. Oh, that's but interesting. Suppose, if you like neon signs, you might check out Michelangelo's sign shop. Oh, Michelangelo's? That's good. That's he really... He also makes frozen dinners. Does he? 
Do you like sugar? Why sugar? He's the maximum utmost. That doesn't tell me anything, ma'am. We wouldn't have this Yeah. He's the most. Well, of course I am, silly. Mr. House is just the smartest, most wonderful man there ever was. Why, sure. Did you know he single-handedly reclaimed New Vegas from all those nasty Remember when Sigourney Weaver voiced, uh, Hal? Single-handedly sent in his oh, yeah. girl Hal. Yeah, she did, didn't she? Gal. Just having one of those <laughs> manic Mondays. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. ...is an exact copy of Mr. House's favorite girl. Oh. Mr. House has a lot of needs, Sugar. I take care of all of them, and a lady doesn't kiss and tell. This is so Futurama. Then maybe you shouldn't pry into a lady's particulars. Mm -hmm. You know what? She's Fair. got you there. Yeah, you know what? She got me. Any... This is the Lucky 38 Resort and Casino, or it used to be. Mr. House has kept the place locked up tight for ages now. Ooh, that's Nobody weird. comes in or out. Ew, weird. Why, I'm a Robco PDQ 88B Mark I Securitron, you silly goose. You silly <laughs> goose. Oh silly my god. Goose. Yeah, oh my god, this is silly. Not many people know this, but Mr. House is one of the world's biggest collectors of antique snow globes. If you happen to find any out in the wasteland, you can Ooh. bring them to me. And I'll add them to his collection. He'll get a reward, of course. It's okay, baby. In fact, one of Mr. House's favorites went missing when we moved the collection. Mm. If you have a look around the Lucky 38, you might even find it. Ooh, interesting. You so this is telling you do. So this is just telling you about snow globes. Mm-hmm. I mean, when you first find a snow globe, you get told about snow globes, but you don't yeah. tell. They, you don't know who yeah. has the snow go co collection until you get here. Wow. Huh. This meeting has been a long time coming, hasn't it? What? You've come a long ways, literally, and I suspect figuratively as well. Did you I not know ask, about Mr. House? Now that you've reached no. your destination. What do you make of what you see? Walt Disney looking ass. Yeah. Yeah, it's like, what the? A crude question, crudely asked. Shut up, Mr. House. Seriously, what the hell are you, bud? Curiosity at a more appropriate moment. But now, I'll repeat my question. What do you make of what you see? Oh my god, you're such an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> this big iron plays in the background. Oh, that's so good. Uh, I do kind of prefer the wasteland if I'm being real here. Like, this is neat and all, but it it's so fake. <laughs> you aren't going to ramble on about the virtues of life out in the wastes, are you? It's a desert, you do realize. A radioactive desert where humans subsist in a barbaric state. Difficult to glorify convincingly. They are, however, aptly named. Connection no, lost. Blamal. Wasted. Here on the strip, your talents can be put to use. I know, what, what, what are you on about, bud? Hmm? Oh, don't be coy. You've been playing a high-stakes game ever since Victor dug you out of the ground. Don't be afraid to admit it. <sighs> The business is this. One of my employees has stolen an item of extraordinary value from me, and I want it recovered. Simple enough. What did you wish to know? My only concern yeah. is the recovery. Okay, of my well, budget. that's what we what were looking for originally. I leave to your discretion. When you bring <laughs> Oh, bidding me, pay you four times bidding me, biting me. Put her over here. How's that? Uh, fucking kitty. Ow, well, ow, ow, ow. Return. 
It won't be easy. Benny is always surrounded by at least four Oof. bodyguards, except when he's in his private suite on the 13th floor of the tops. I see. It's more complicated than that. The chairmen share what you might call a tribal affinity. Mm. Look for a man named Swank, Benny's second in command. He's always been a reliable, if unimaginative, employee. Do your best to convince him that you're working under my auspices. If you have evidence of Benny's crimes, show it to him. Mm. By contract, Securitrons are to enter the casinos only when invited by the three families or if other extraordinary circumstances. Ah, arise. interesting. The moment I send one into the tops, Benny will know I'm on to him. What? Sneaking into Benny's suite on the 13th floor would be very difficult, but not impossible. There might be guards. Certainly, there'd be a sturdy lock on his front door. Hmm. If you were to, I I the missed public, this. You might be able to leverage his fear of exposure to make him agree to meet with you in private. Hmm. Close the face. Mm. Benny has led the chairman ever since I recorded. Oh, good. So Benny's in charge of the chairman for the casino. Until his Great. Misbehavior. I plan to make him my protege. Maybe if I'd begun grooming him sooner, none of this would have happened. Mm. To achieve my aims, I require a capable human agent to perform certain tasks. I knew Benny was ambitious, even ruthless, but I believed he would do the job so long as he was incentivized appropriately. Mm. Obviously, I miscalculated his drive for supremacy, but in any case, you've come along. A more than suitable replacement. I have to think that he found out about the platinum chip and mistakenly convinced himself that he could use it to his own ends. Okay. One of the problems of a tribal workforce, I'm afraid. No intuitive sir. understanding of how uh, sir. Be. Why didn't Victor Things come out of his mouth? Sooner? Yeah, he sure is saying. I think that's the point: is that he's a fucking awful dude. But agent by remote, I can send and receive packets of data at best. Victor's combat algorithms determine the proper course of action. Benny and his thugs were more than a match for a lone Securitron. Mm. When he alerted me, I instructed him to approach the site after Benny and the others had departed. Ugh. It's a very special item. There's nothing else like it yeah, in the entire yeah. world. Yeah, what am I fighting it over, was bud? lost a long time and difficult to find. That's all you need to know platinum about the tortilla chip. our enterprise. Oh, uh, I don't want to eat a platinum tortilla chip. chip. That's probably a very Good expensive chip. Will come your way. Mm -hmm. Now you want to make You might one. keep an eye out for any computers that Benny's been using. Maybe even a computer lab of some sort. Ooh. That's simply not true. That is. I am the what are you talking about? Rights pertaining to the chip. I designed it and I paid for it dearly. To develop mm. that chip, I spent a sum of U.S. dollars, not the bottle caps that pass as currency these days, but a sum beyond counting. Mm. For decades, I paid salvagers to comb the ruins for it, and when it was finally discovered, tens of thousands of caps spent to have it brought here. We know how that turned out. Complete your contract, and it will be the last time I pay for the chip. <sighs> you realize you were just one of many couriers. Add to that many thousands of caps worth of mercenary protection to screen your avenue of approach. Had I used an Oy. armed caravan to transport the chip, I might as well have been announcing to the world, this is important, attack this. So whatever we were doing before we were woken up by the dock, we we were playing a game where we had no control. Holy shit. It was rigged from the start. It was rigged from the start, baby! That... It was rigged from the start. It... Like he said. I wonder if... Oh my god. If Benny... Oh my god, this is... A... 
Fuck! <laughs> uh. Frontal assaults on casinos, not good for business. In any case, oh my goodness, uh, my brain is melting. My brain is melting at this. Our foremost advantage is that Benny doesn't know that I know he has the chip. I see. I am Robert Edwin House, president wow. CEO and sole proprietor of the new Vegas Strip. I oversaw the city's renovations starting from 2274 onward. The three families are my employees. Before the Great War of 2077, I was the founder, president, and CEO of Robco Industries. Oh! A vast computer and robotics corporation. Oh! What? Yeah. He was the founder and CEO of Robco? Yep. Don't let the video screens and computer terminals fool you. I'm flesh and blood, not silicon. I have a feeling we're going to see a brain in a jar at some point. No. While brains demonstrated some use as organic processors in the robots produced by General Atomics International, they never retained personality. Oh yeah, in Fallout 3, there are robots that are essentially brain jars. I remember that. Let's Robo brains. Say it was very... Robo great. brains. I love them. But I was willing to make the sacrifices longevity entailed, financial and otherwise. We can discuss this in greater detail at another time. Suffice mm. it to say that when my Securitrons, I recruited a tribal force to supplement my Securitrons and renovated the Strip just in time to welcome the NCR as it marched into the region. Instead of war, a treaty was negotiated and the money started to pour in. Mm. It's, about not, it's about the money, Spider-Man. It's about the money, Spider. It's not about the money, Spider Man. It's about the Nets, baby. The, the, the Mets, the baby. Nets, the Mets, baby. baby. The Mets. Come on, let's go, Mets. Come on, it home run. Let's go, Mets. Come on. <laughs> That's one of my favorite memes. It's really good. It's it's about the Mets, Spider Man. The Mets. <laughs> it's understandable that you'd be curious about this topic, but we'll hold off until the platinum chip has been covered. Good God. Alrighty. Fuck. You learned a lot. My brain so is. So many things. Congratulations, partner. The boss has instructed me to comp you to the high roller suite. Yeah, hey, there's a high roller. Bring your friends too. Yeah. Hey, there's a high roller. Can you put together? Just bear in mind, you're the only one gets to see the boss. Any friends you got, they can wait in the suite. And so you got a new little house. So, wait, so uh, so all the followers I recruit go up to that suite, or it's just the ones I have on me? You can have them stay there if you want. Yeah. Okay. I so, think they're just waiting outside the casino for right now. Well, let's, let's see the suite before we log out today. It's pretty nice. Pretty swanky. I roll her suite. Damn. Activate and you terminal. can buy stuff for it, too. Oh, wow. Lockers, fridges, wardrobes. Wow. Sasparilla vending machine? That's pretty cool. Grumpy mm -hmm. kitty. Wow. Yeah. This is a lot of stuff. I'm just gonna get that all set up. You did it. You, I run Barter Town, baby. All right. Wow. Crying because I'm holding her here. <laughs> so, wow. Look at this fucking big ass bathroom. Jesus. They got yeah, multiple yeah. tubs, so. Damn. You got some offices. You got some beds. Swanky. Now, this That's is nice. a big. This is a base of operation. Mm -hmm. It is the presidential suite. Damn. 
you Get know. all your boys in here. It's true. Another bedroom and office. Damn. Open weapon trunk. This must be my room. Mm-hmm. I mean, the whole place is yours. Well, yeah, but you know, you you know what I mean. That must be the master bedroom. Yeah. There's a little pool table. Wow. Play some pool. This place slaps. Oh no, there's only one bed. Oh my god. <laughs> well, there's there's more than one actually. It's but... like Boone, you better crawl in here. Everybody get every you and all your followers side by side in the bed with little nightcaps, telling each other good night one there... at a time. There has to be, there has to be fan art of that. <laughs> there has to be. Like, there, there actually has to be. That's so, that's like impossibly cute. It has to be. Perhaps. Recycle all my ammunition. Open fridge. Wow! Look at that! Damn! You got room for the whole presidential cabinet. Everybody can have food. Everybody. Weird, but I can smell this room. It's huh? this room. Weird, it smells room. like tobacco. It doesn't even smell like cigarettes. It just smells like straight it up tobacco. Like, it smells like Aunt Ruth's house. It smells like tobacco, but like a really good quality. Tobacco. Yeah, like high quality. Oh, must. Yeah, like must tobacco. Yeah, you could smell like. Oh my god. Oh, this is so neat. Well, you were talking to Mr. House for a while. Some Securitrons could have gone in there and made a made some made it smell nice. It's true. They could have made it made it smell good. Can't really get the smell out of the tobacco out of here, but it's yeah. true. All right. Well, we've been at this for a little over two hours, and this has been a banger stream. It's a good one. This day, to, I, I think today went well. We made a lot of progress. We met Mr. House, which is. Whole, my brain is fucking melting. 